San Francisco owns and operates six public golf courses. One of them, the Sharp Park Golf Course, is located in Pacifica at the end of the large Sanchez Creek watershed. Because much of the course is at or below sea level, flooding from the creek makes the course inaccessible for months at a time, but it makes a perfect wetland home for two endangered species, the California red-legged frog and the San Francisco garter snake. When the winter rains hit, the golf course floods. So they turn a pump house on and they drain the water away and send it out to the ocean. But when they do that, that leaves the frogs' egg masses high and dry, exposed to the air, and an entire generation of frogs dries out and is lost. The snake is killed in a different way. We've got dead bodies of San Francisco garter snakes confirmed by U.S. Fish and Wildlife Service that have been killed by lawnmowers at Sharp Park. And the garter snake is very rare. So you lose even one individual, you're talking 5-10% of the entire population of the species at Sharp Park. And on top of that, year after year, the golf course is losing tens to hundreds of thousands of dollars of taxpayer money subsidizing suburban golf in San Mateo County. Since 2004, nearly a million dollars has come out of San Francisco's general fund to cover the cost of things like maintenance and draining the golf course when it floods. What's worse? is that the improvements needed to continue golf at Sharp Park could cost as much as $50 million. Over the long run, Sharp Park Golf Course cannot be maintained in its existing location. With sea level rise and climate change, the ocean is gonna slowly move inland and upland and just absorb that golf course into a new expanded ocean. Currently, San Francisco has a budget deficit of a half a billion dollars at a time when resources are scarce for things like human services, neighborhood parks, and schools. It just doesn't make sense to continue wasting taxpayer dollars on an unsustainable golf course. So we've got a better plan for Sharp Park. We've got a plan that will save San Francisco money, create a recreational opportunity that everybody can enjoy, and actually save two endangered species that are on the brink of extinction. And that's to restore Sharp Park and integrate land management with the adjacent national park properties that are all part of the Golden Gate National Recreation Area. Join our campaign to restore Sharp Park by signing the online petition. Together, we can save taxpayer dollars, endangered species, and create more open space for all of us to enjoy.